Hey everybody, today I'm showing you another cool desktop Tesla coil that puts on a show when you turn it on. It creates impressive arcs and it's pretty compact so it actually fits even in the smallest rooms and it's great for science demonstrations. Let's see what this is capable of. So just like all other similar desktop Tesla coils, this has knobs for adjusting frequency and power. The design also is pretty similar. Just have to install it here and we're set. You are going to need a 48 volt adapter for this. So get these little bulbs for demonstration. So this is the side that you put here and There you go, it's now ready to go. You just have to attach the rest of it. One thing that you just wanna be careful about, these are sharp. So if you're giving it to a young student or someone who's new, you wanna just be careful they don't poke themselves with this. So pretty simple, you can use these knobs to adjust the frequency and length of the arc. It can be pretty loud, but at the same time it's a pretty cool science toy and it puts on a show and it's especially great in the dark. You can use it to light up, let's say neon tubes or balls or all kinds of things. I have a neon keychain. I'm gonna put it here. See if I can actually get it. This also has a Bluetooth mode where once you turn it on, you just have to go to your smartphone. So it's not connected. Now you're going to need a square wave music. I actually created my own music, but it didn't turn out well. But these guys also send you some. So if you play unoptimized music, you get something like this. It's not pleasant to hear and also it could damage the coil. So you want to be careful with that. There are tools that let you, you can go to Audacity for instance, and it takes a little bit of work to create your own square wave music, but you can download it online from various sources to test it if you just want to make sure that this feature works. So that's about it. Another cool Tesla coil 
that can use to experiment and also for demonstration. It's not particularly huge. The arc obviously is limited as far as the length. So it is on the surface safer side. You want to take precaution, make sure that you don't poke yourself or don't get this next to an inflammable material. So there are some things that you want to be careful when using Tesla coils. But other than that, a pretty cool device that you can use to play music or just experiment. For more information on Tesla Quartz, please go to Gadgetify.com. Also, my channel Gadgetify on YouTube. I've covered a lot of Tesla Quartz and also plasma lamps and lumen glass and crackle tubes and things like that. Thanks again for watching.